Sport is supposed to be safe, so it's difficult for the entire community. It's, an, uh, it's difficult for me, who has teenagers playing sports. A former Winnipeg hockey coach in her 20s is facing a litany of charges after police say she had an exploitative relationship with an underage hockey player. 20-year-old Madison Billick is facing 15 charges after Winnipeg police allege the suspect coerced and abused the victim during the inappropriate relationship. Those charges include sexual assault, sexual exploitation, luring a person under 16 and 18, possession of child pornography and assault with a weapon. Police say the relationship not only started while the suspect coached the victim, but continued even after the victim stopped playing hockey, with it taking place between 2019 and 2021. According to the WPS, Billick was affiliated with Hockey Manitoba as a coach from 2018 to 2023. This wasn't just limited to a, a rink scenario. This was a relationship that extended after hours um, over the course of this time um, with solitary uh, meetings between the two people. In a joint statement released Friday by Hockey Manitoba, Hockey Winnipeg and Hockey Canada, the three organizations say they first learned about the alleged relationship in October from a video circulating online. According to the organizations, they notified Winnipeg police about the alleged incident and also referred it to Hockey Canada's independent third party. The statement goes on to say that all three organizations, quote, take allegations of this nature extremely seriously and the individual is ineligible to participate in Hockey Canada sanctioned programs, including as a coach, guest coach or volunteer, while the independent third party complaint process is ongoing. Kyle Willis is the director of the Interlake Minor Hockey Association. He confirmed to City News that Billick used to be a coach for one of the female U18 AAA hockey teams part of the association. He says he was shocked when he first saw the video. You know, my daughter plays. Um and in the same league, so you never want to hear about that or see it. Willis said other than the expected complaints from parents about coaching performance, the association was unaware of the alleged conduct of Billick prior to a video that circulated online. He's also applauding the victim for her bravery and is urging any other victims to come forward. In Winnipeg, Edward Jan, City News.